In this short tutorial, I will show you how to set up call forwarding or how to call specific DSS user. Okay, so let's start. First, go to setup. Go to your video intercom. Now, in video intercom, you can go to main menu. You will see something like this, couple of your VTOs. Then you have man manager group config and relationship configuration. Probably you have only one group over here, which is default manager group. You can, of course, create more groups. How to create a group? For example, I will cre create group one door. I will select the user and click OK. Once you select the user over here, it will be automatically deducted from the default manager group. So OK you see the user is out so that's how you actually create the new group then the second step is to go to relation group configuration you can do one setup for all of your vtos or setup for each vto independently so i will show you how to do it independently set up one of your vto for example this one and the groups who should be called. So I will choose mobile one, one door and default manager. You see they are in specific order. So the mobile group will be called as the first one, then one door group and then default manager group. Each after 30 seconds if no one pick up the call. Please don't forget to set up the group for the name. So for example, new group. and click OK. So now we got this new group and you can see the new group is assigned to unit VTO group 2. Now I will delete this. I will show you how it works with the setup which I had before. OK, so now I got two of my VTOs which can call me on my DSS device. As you see, first one, they are going to call to my mobile phone and then to default manager group. So let's show you how it works. I log in to my application in DSS on my mobile phone and I'm going to call from the VTO to DSS client. You can hear that at the moment my phone is, is ringing, but on the PC you don't see anything. Now I just hang up the call over here on my phone. In additional 5 seconds, you will see that the call will pop up on my operator screen as a DSS user, since I'm in different calling group. As you can see, the call pop up on my screen. So this is the proof that my setup works. You can answer the call or unlock the door. Up to you. Okay, so that's it. It's pretty easy. Use it. Thank you very much for watching.